so welcome back everybody um, this is gonna be this is gonna be a quick little video because I think the point gets across better when we do small chunks of things at once rather than a long 20 minute video of a whole bunch of information so uh, what we're gonna do is I recently had someone comment that watched one of my other videos and they were asking me a question of how can you take a video that already has audio as a part of it and insert some other audio in place of a certain piece of audio in the movie that you're trying to edit so in this example you can see that I have this this video here that has video and audio and you can tell that because in track number one is video track number two is audio uh, they both say one because it's technically a track is video and audio but I think you get the point so if I want to cut a piece of audio out of this but I want to leave the video there. Okay, the first thing you need to do is click on click on the track and you can see that uh, everything lights up blue at the same time. That means that the audio and the video are grouped together. So at this point you can't just edit the audio or the video or cut just a piece of audio out. You'd have to you would have to cut both. So for instance, so if I drag my cursor over here and I want to uh, try to try to cut this and insert some audio, watch what happens. So you hit split the selected clip and as you see it split it split the whole clip the video and the audio at the same point. So if you try to do a another cut, like if I click here and I do another split, then you can't keep just this piece of video. It's going to cut it's going to delete both the audio and the video at the same time. And I'll show you why. So if you right click on your mouse uh, while hovered over the track You'll see this here, it says link slash unlink video and audio. So if you left click on that, you will see that if you look real closely, now you can tell that they're separate. So then we could we could remove we could remove the audio clip and if you want to put something in place of it, um, you could just say remove and leave gap. So then it's not going to mess with the timing of the rest of your track. You'll just have a blank space here. So what will happen is I'll go ahead and play this and you'll hear me talking. This is one of my older videos. And then you'll see what happens when it gets to the spot you just cut out. there's no audio there so now let's say let's say this was your video and you wanted to cut out a certain piece of audio and insert some music so then I have a music track right here that I already imported come on there you go so I'm gonna go ahead and put it here and then get the little arrows to come up on the end then you can resize it down until the big line turns blue then you know you're perfectly lined up alright so now let's see what happens the music's probably going to be a bit loud so brace yourself So 
As you can see, the video plays along with the audio because they're linked together. And then when it gets to this point, the video stays, but you deleted the audio and inserted some music. So you can do this anywhere. Um, you could unlink all the video and audio. And you could do this, you could do this anywhere. Um, so that's kind of what I wanted to show for this video just how the video and audio can be linked together um, and then how you can cut out a piece of audio and insert whatever you want in place of it. Um, I do believe you could pull this up and you could put it you could put it on there um, or you know sometimes if it's something separate you know I'll put it down here on uh, on its own separate track and it'll still play the same um, now the same goes with the same goes with video you could do the same exact thing we just did with say a picture um, let me see let me import a picture real quick and I'll just show you Let's see, let's get one of my dog when he was eight weeks old. So we'll go ahead and import this picture. And what we'll do is we'll drag this picture in here like so. We'll drag it over to match. Okay, now something very interesting happens here. Okay, because you have you have two two pieces of video overlapping each other. So now you could do one of two things. You could you can right click on this video track and you can remove it and leave a gap. So then all it shows is this picture or what you could do is you can you can resize the picture to overtake the other picture So now both videos are there, but only one shows. And this is how you also, how you do uh, picture in picture, which I do believe I covered in one of my other videos. So you can see I could make this real small. Like if I was doing uh, like gaming or something, you know, I could, I could have the game displayed here, which would be here, uh, and then I could also have a second video check that's a webcam of my face, and I could just put it up here in the corner and resize it. So, hopefully this helps. Um, there will be more videos to come. Uh, I plan on doing some videos uh, on some really basic stuff, but actually just going through and really showing how to do everything step by step um, as if you had never used this software before. So again, I hope you enjoyed this and stay tuned because there's more to come.